Ah, oh, man. The King of Fighters franchise is... I don't know if I want to call it underrated, but, like... I don't want to call it... It's not overrated, for sure. It's... 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 Yeah, I'll say underrated. Like... When I was a kid, like, I didn't know what King of Fighters was. Like... It was all new to me and stuff. And... When my cousin got it... Like... When my cousin got the game on PlayStation, I think it was 98 or 99. I, I could be wrong. It's been a while. But, um... When he initially when he got it and stuff like that, I was just enamored about another just fighting game that came out and stuff like that compared to um, Street Fighter and of course Marvel and stuff. And I just like I just liked the sprites and stuff like that I was for it. And I I didn't go to Terry obviously like me being like you know a prepubescent teen and so that I went for my because you know. But that being said, it doesn't change the fact that. I, um, it doesn't change the fact that I had fun and stuff like that. Like, later on, I chose Terry because, I don't know, something, something gravitated me towards him, specifically around, um, the CVS time, you know? I think maybe it was just him using Buster Wolf or whatnot, but I don't know. I just, I just been enjoying Terry ever since. Um, that being said, though, like, I, like I said, I really do enjoy the series. I like the sprites and all that stuff. The music's kind of, it's, it's a vibe, you know? And I was more interested in King Fighters than anything else than what SK had. And me playing, me playing um, SK, obviously King Fighters stuff that brought me to playing the other games like, you know, Sam Show, OG Fail Fury, and even Garo and stuff, like on Dream, back on Dreamcast, when I had a Dreamcast. Well, when I had my first Dreamcast. And I personally feel like that it gets a lot of... It doesn't get as represented represented here in the States compared to, um, you know, other parts of the world, especially in Mexico, because going down there, seeing my Pinimos play in the arcades, some of that, is just friggin' amazing and stuff. And while compared to... While compared to um, the other... Compared to the other big games, you know, I'm just glad that it's still getting its own... Um, it's in Gun Zone game with uh, Garo 2 coming out right now and stuff. And, well, we'll get to see what entails the story for KOF. And this boy Rock right here. I know I just lost Terry. And I'm pretty sure you can hear like the sounds coming from my controller and stuff. But, oh man, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting beat up by a bot. <laughs> this is what happens when you'll play a fighting game for a while. But, that's why I can't dinosaurs. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm just excited to see what they have. What um, I'm excited to see what um, is in store for the. I'm excited to see what's in store for um, this the new. Is it City of City of Wolves? Is that what it's called? I think. Yeah, I'm excited to see what's in store for City of Wolves. And I hope that you know. SK gets more recognition 